Well, it's service to America Day at Montana Fair as we honor veterans and first responders in the wake of last weekend's hailstorm. Q2's Rob Griggs brings this one group of local rescuers into focus. Rob? Well, you know, Friday at Montana Fair is First Responders Day, and although Yellowstone Valley Electric Cooperative might not be considered in the genre of first responders as we typically think of them, uh, Brandon Whitman, I know your company was a first responder in the Shepherd area after the storm on Sunday. We were. We had uh, a lot of outages. We had 3,700 meters at the high point of the outage. Okay. So uh, the storm came in. Uh, I know your crew just jumped on the job. How did your crew do with this? Oh, I'll tell you what. I, I'm very impressed with what they did to start with. Uh, a lot of them live in the areas that were affected. So a lot of their homes, uh, their vehicles were damaged and they kind of set that aside and they went to work for our members. So it was very impressive. We know it was very late in the season for this magnitude of storm. Uh, how were the folks out in Shepherd and the folks you worked with? Did they understand what you guys were up against? They were extremely patient. Uh, we had another incident on Monday after we got uh, the outage numbers down to about 300 meters. Had a car wreck on the west end. All of a sudden the numbers went up to 700 meters back out of power. But there was a lot of patience from our members. Uh, they knew our guys were out there working hard. They knew they were eventually going to be next. All right. Brandon, we're coming into a uh, first uh, weekend after that storm. What's the status? Are we pretty much mopped up now? We are. Yeah, we're just cleaning up some trees and that sort of thing. But everybody was back in power within 48 hours. And uh, yeah, we're just cleaning things up now. Okay, well, so that's good news because I know Brandon is so excited about his crew that probably there'll be footlong corn dogs for everybody. Uh, sure, let's go with that. I like it. <laughs> I just sort of threw that one out. Uh, it's a great night to be out here at uh, Montana Fair. Brandon Whitman, thank you very much for taking time to visit with us. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. Let's toss it back to the studio. All right. Thanks, Rob. Service to America Day at Montana Fair includes free gate admission for veterans and first responders and a guest, plus a pair of rodeo tickets for tonight. An official presentation involving a flyover will happen at 645 this evening.